Hey everyone, my name is David Dunbar, or the Theme Park Evangelist. I am currently on the Blue Ridge Parkway, and I wanted you guys to see this incredible view. It is so windy right now, but as you guys can see, there are nothing but mountains directly behind me right now, and I'm just like, wow. And it's kind of cold up here, to be honest with you. But uh, you guys might see it better if I turn the camera around. I mean, check this out. Isn't that just incredible? I mean, wow. <laughs> just a small taste of um, what I am enjoying up here in the western North Carolina mountains. I think everybody's ready to go. We're gonna actually uh, change of plans. We are now going to uh, Mount Mitchell. Um, don't know why 100% but anyway time's up so I gotta hop in the car and let's get going. So I am currently at Mount Mitchell State Park, the highest point in western slash eastern North Carolina. The uh, temperature is currently in the mid to high 30s with a wind chill factor. So it probably feels like it's in the 20s right now. Hi. And of course, what did I forget to bring today? Not just a hat, but gloves. My hands are numb. <laughs> Yes, as you can tell, Katie is very cold right now. So uh, it took us about 20 minutes, but we finally found a restroom. And uh, we were just over by the restaurant, which unfortunately is closed for the season. And... Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw that. And of course, the wind was so bad. It's so cold up here. It's healing right now. So we're gonna put sleeting. sleeting. So I think we're gonna go to the observation tower. So this ought to be really the interesting. Tower's up. Yeah, we have to go keep going up now. I don't think we're gonna go back up. Oh, we're not gonna go up? No, I don't think so. Oh, so I don't know where we're gonna go next then. But I'm gonna go sit up front now, I guess. All right, so we're in downtown Burnsville right now. And it's not as cold as it was earlier. But yeah, we were on top of Mount Mitchell, which was over yeah. 6,000 feet. The highest mountain east of the Mississippi. East of the Mississippi, thank you. But we were over 6,000 feet above sea level the last time you saw us, which was on the last clip, of course. But we just ate at... Okay. What was the name of that restaurant that we ate at? The Pacifica. So now we're going to go and check out this visitor center and we're heading towards the pottery store. Sorry. Oh wow. Check this out. 1922 Dodge Roadster. Wow. That's cool. All right. Let's go on in. Cool. Okay. The guy will do that. So I don't think that octopus agreed with me because I just had a little episode in the restroom and that's as far as I'm going with that. So Katie wants to go into, what was it? Something special is right here. And, oh. Here's the entrance. But yeah, we're still in uh, downtown Burnsville. Just got some bad news from TJ. Just be praying for him. He's um, mentally not doing well right now. And that's as much as I'm allowed to say about that. But um, I did want to show you guys at least the Christmas decorations around here. So yeah, as you guys can see, uh, they got this whole area decorated for Christmas. So another very pretty area. 
Now, you might be wondering, like, David, why do you call yourself the theme park evangelist if all you're showing right now is, um, you know, downtown sections? Because ever since I moved to northern Kentucky, I've done more than just theme parks. I've shown um, the Strawberry Festival at Florida, which I started doing after I moved. I also like to go into new places. I also, um, ever since I started dating Katie, I've gotten more into um, hiking and doing stuff around North Carolina, which is the state I'm currently in. And I also like to show people like different um, fairs and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, the main focus of my YouTube channel is theme parks like when I'm in Northern Kentucky, I like going to Kings Island, and then this weekend I'm going to Dollywood. So, don't worry. I always make sure there's a theme park that I'm going to be vlogging even when I'm on vacation. So, if you're like, oh, this YouTube channel sucks because he's the theme park evangelist and he's not, like, advertising what he preaches. <laughs> so... If um, you're only interested in the theme park stuff, that's okay. I have plenty of theme park um, content on my YouTube channel. I have at least 500 vlogs of theme park content. I have them listed in my Disney World vlogs, my Universal vlogs, my Kings Island vlogs, the Legoland vlogs, Bush Garden vlogs, SeaWorld vlogs. You name it, I got it. The only play state I have not been to yet that has a theme park is California. And I still want to go to Carowinds here in this state as well. I think that would be a really cool opportunity. And uh, I've only been to Dollywood once. This is my second time going back, and that's this weekend. I even have Tennessee vlogs, and of course, that's where my uh, Dollywood vlog is. My only one as of right now, but I'm about to add on vlog number two on uh, this weekend, Thanksgiving weekend. All right, let me go join Katie in this uh, cute little store called Something Special. So, definitely a very interesting day today. Um, we uh, drove the entire Blue Ridge Parkway, which actually, um, I want to show you guys the map in just a little bit. I'm uh, ending my vlog. But I wanted to show everybody the Blue Ridge Parkway before I officially end it, if that makes any sense. Um, yeah, where's the map? Upstairs. Remember, there's a map of the Blue Ridge Parkway. Let then. See, there's actually something right here. Right? This has got a map in it. Yeah. Get it. Well, there's that big map upstairs. Yeah, I know. I'm just going to say there's anything in here. Sure. So then we uh, attempted to go to the highest point of the... Um, of North Carolina or this of the eastern side of the Mississippi and the temperature went from 50 degrees to 33 33 with wind chill and it was sleeting that was fun then we uh, went down to downtown Burnsville we had dinner I tried octopus for my very first time and then it caused me to have to run to the restroom then from there, um, got Katie got sick. We did a little shopping in downtown Burnsville. We went to this place called Harf Glass and Gallery. We got to see some blown glass. I've never seen that before in my life, as cool as that is. So, by the way, we still got to do laundry tonight. Mm -hmm. So I got to get out of these, actually, and get in my pajamas. That's fine. You can watch TV and your pajamas. That's what I'm doing. And then, um... We uh, went to this observatory, and it was pitch black, and of course we started hearing gunshots, and Katie got freaked out. She was like, ah! I tried to do a vlog or a clip there, but it was too dark, so nobody could have seen me at all. Then we came back here, and here it is, almost 7 o'clock. Okay, this might work. Let's try it. So, we started right about here somewhere, little Switzerland. Am I correct? We started right here. Mm -hmm. We followed this path mm -hmm. right through here. Mm -hmm. 
So this is the this is the river on the Blue Ridge Parkway. Yep. Came down. Right up here. Went all the way up through the Black Mountains and went all the way up here. We never did go to this observatory right here because it was so foggy. It was ridiculous. You wouldn't have been able to see anything. You wouldn't have been able to see anything. Then we went down here. So that's where we were earlier. And where is this observatory at? Mm, I forget. It's right outside of it. So we were like in this vicinity afterwards. And now we're back over here again. All right, guys, so that is officially the end of my vlog. We will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow is officially our engagement. We have been waiting for this day for several months now. If by tomorrow, you can officially call her the future Mrs. Dunbar. Crazy, right? So... Uh, tomorrow, the uh, other than getting engaged and finally having our Thanksgiving dinner, Katie has been wanting to take me to Grandfather Mountain, a place that her parents grew, brought her up. Oh no, what happened? No, no, I just said something about Katie. A place that her parents brought her uh, up for her entire life. And tomorrow is finally going to be the day that I get to try the mile high swinging bridge and it literally is a mile high i've seen a picture of it i was like <laughs> so lord willing we'll definitely make sure it happens tomorrow uh, hopefully her parents won't just back out of the last minute gotta try out a uh interesting coffee shop today called books and beans if i'm not mistaken mm -hmm. who knows what coffee shop we'll go to tomorrow but we will see you guys in the next vlog tomorrow no matter what and always remember you can do all things through crisis strengthens you. Have a great night. Peace out.